You can't handle Manhattan, Kansas the same way as Manhattan, New York. Hey, what do you hear? What do you say? My Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, your sister's ass, the Pony Express, a very ticked off Vic here. You know what ticks me off? We still don't have a real plan for opening this country. Enough is enough already. We need the federal government to finally give us a real plan. Look, I don't have all the answers. I don't even know if I have one answer. I'm just raising the questions. This whole, should we be open? Should we be closed? Should we wear masks? Should we not wear masks? Should we go to work? Should we stay home? You can work at McDonald's, but you can't get a haircut. You can walk on the beach, but you can't sit on the beach. Stop with the mixed messages. Can the federal government come up with a real motherfucking plan and put it in place already? Don't gaslight me. Don't lie to me. I don't want your bullshit. I don't want any more partisan fuckery. I just want a plan to get this country up and running and be safe for all citizens now. We have 50 states spinning in a billion different directions with no federal plan to guide the effort. Look at it like a football team. You have 50 players on a team, each with their own talents. But you need a head coach and assistant coaches to give them a plan that makes them work together and accomplish their goals. You can't handle Manhattan, Kansas the same way as Manhattan, New York. There needs to be a federal oversight to help coordinate this. And of course, who's going to take it on the chin again? The working man. Who's the most vulnerable if there's no plan? The working man. You can't fix someone's plumbing unless you can leave your house. You can't stock the grocery shelf unless you can leave your house. And it's not about, well then, just leave your house. We need to open the country with a national plan so it's as safe as possible. There's always been a national plan for anything and everything for a reason. We need to do the important stuff. Testing, tracing, quarantining as needed. I'm not an expert. But I don't need to be a mechanic to put gas in my car or be a dentist to know how to floss my teeth. I know when something's fucked up. Just fix it! Stop playing politics with a pandemic, you fucking hairless nutsacks. We need a plan for all the people of the U.S. We are all U.S. citizens. We are all Americans, goddammit. Stop this divisive shit already. I can tell you this, Richie Rich has no fucking problems living on Easy Street with a vault full of gold. But Bobby Landscape and Harry Factory Worker and Debbie Hairdresser and Ricky Restaurant and Betty Bar Owner and all the other people living paycheck to paycheck with their small business clothes needs to earn money again and there will be nothing to come back to. At this point, this is becoming a battle between the haves and the have-nots. The people with lots of money have no fucking problem riding this pandemic out. Oh, sure, I'll go to my beach house over there and I'll go to my island over there. But what about the have-nots? The working people, the vast majority of this country, we are dying over here. We're confused. We get mixed messages. We can't wait this pandemic out for a vaccine or a cure, but we need to open up now and do it as safely as possible. We need a plan now. You people, you fucking people, you keep fighting each other and making this a partisan shit show. You keep letting the politicians get away with murder. You keep letting the rich get richer while we all fight for scraps. Don't you get it? Don't you see? Don't you understand? Your brothers and sisters on the other side of the politics are also cops. They're also nurses. They're also union members. They're also factory workers. Your brothers and sisters from the other side of politics also live in your state, your city, your town. They are your relatives and your friends and your co-workers and teammates. Jesus. Jesus Christ, we are fighting the wrong battle. Somehow these fucking politicians have blue-collar workers from both sides fighting each other for no fucking reason while the filthy rich laugh and shit and spit and piss on us all. We need a fucking plan already for all Americans, for the entire country, to get back to work. Nobody is stopping this administration from doing the right thing. Nobody is stopping the Senate or the Congress from doing the right thing. Nobody is stopping anybody. Just do the right fucking thing already. Come up with a real plan and get this country safely back to work. Now, we still don't have a real plan for opening this country. That's what fucking ticks me off. All right, let me get a cup of coffee and my reading glasses and read what a shit show this video will create. God help us all.